Today I want to talk to you about the difference between gluten and fructans in wheat, barley and rye. My name is Suzanne Perazzini and I'm the author of two low FODMAP cookbooks and the creator of two low FODMAP coaching programs. So there is a lot of confusion between gluten-free and wheat-free. Now if you go wheat-free, that means that you are partially gluten-free. The gluten is the protein part of wheat, barley and rye. But recently there's been a lot of research and talk about the fact that in fact there is another part to the wheat, barley and rye and that's the carbohydrate part or the fructans and that this in fact is what has been causing the problem all along. Now this was actually discovered way back in 1997 but the actual research studies have only been done recently, more recently at least, 2006-2008. The studies were done about the low FODMAP diet, which is low carbohydrates. And that's when they discovered that in fact it was the fructans in wheat, barley and rye that were causing a lot of digestive issues and not the gluten, unless of course you are celiac and that is a well recognized disorder. So the fructans are the carbohydrates, the gluten are the proteins and it's very possible that your digestive issues are caused by the fructans. At the end of the day the result is exactly the same. If you eliminate wheat, barley and rye you will feel better. But do consider the possibility that the other high FODMAP foods are also a problem which is the other carbohydrates and the high levels in vegetables, beans, uh, grains, fruit and so on. Check those out if you find that your digestive issues continue after eliminating the wheat, the barley and the rye. I hope that has clarified the difference between the gluten and the fructans in wheat, barley and rye. Thank you for watching and goodbye. Ready to take the fast track to an IBS free life? I'll show you how. Get started now. Check out the details at strandsofmylife.com slash IBS free. Your reward will be a joyful, symptom free life.